going inside this one, too? We can do the whole block. It's bad enough you pop the top off of one house and give us a body. What the fuck do you think you're doing now? An experiment. An experiment. <laughs> fuck me. I'm dealing with Madame Curie here. This nail here comes from a nail gun. And it comes from the house with a dead man inside. Every other house has screws that HCD uses. We find these in the plywood anywhere in the city, and there's a body inside. Cash, that's good work. No, I'm very impressed. Do you see a tool belt on me? Do I look like one of those fucking jerk-offs in aisle five of the home fucking depot? There's three weeks left in the year. And our unit clearance rate is under 50%. We do not go looking for bodies, especially moldering fucking John Doe's. We do not put red up on the board voluntarily. Jay, the bodies are in the houses. Marlo Stanfield's bodies. Then they belong to him. Now, I realize you're no longer in my squad, Mr. Major Crimes. But you're still part of CID, right? Look, I'm still a sergeant, right? And I'm giving you an order on this, Lester. Until I feel chain of command out on this, and until you hear otherwise, you will not, I repeat not, pull down any more fucking wood! I mean, you know, I expect a shortfall. When I look at the school budget, it's a natural. How in Christ's name do you lose $54 million? One million at a time. Exactly. It didn't happen this morning. This was on Rice's watch. Now, you didn't get a, a whiff of this during council review? You can't blame the council or Royce for the school budget. The fiscal responsibility is with the school board itself. But the council does have oversight. Don't even pretend to put this shit on me. Only the city share shows up on our budget review. We never see the state money. You better tell your pretty new chief of staff that whatever happens up on North Avenue is on the school system. That's a simplistic view, I think. How would you complicate it? As president of the school board, I'll argue this is a bookkeeping issue. We've simply been rolling the system's debt over since 99. You rolled it and rolled it until it ran out of cash. That's not bookkeeping, that's stupidity. So what are we talking about here? Waste? Fraud? Embezzlement? I would say that although the system has some poor accounting practices, in the end, we're going to find that most of the money was properly spent on programming. OK, 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 we get it. No one's responsible. Then not, not the school board, not anybody on North Avenue, not Clarence Royce, not the city council, no one at this table. Why? Right. So what's our next move? Bump the property tax rate. Scale back our budget. No pay hikes, hiring freezes, reduce services. Tell everyone, schools, police, fire, public works, they have to hold the line for a year or two. How? I just trying to clean up the streets campaign. I just got done promising the world to every cop in the city. Annapolis, you go beg his Republican ass. 